Hello, I'm Anika from Made to Sew and welcome to my What is tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to be explaining the term bust apex or bust point. Now I understand that a lot of you might already know what this term means but I have a lot of tutorials coming in the next few weeks regarding the bust apex. We're going to be looking at how to find the bust apex on a pattern, how to position your bust apex on a pattern, how to raise or lower it, then full bust adjustments, small bust adjustments. So it's really key that you know where it is and how to find it on yourself or whoever it is you're making a garment for. So, got my lovely mannequin here and on her the bust apex is really prominent. It is a black mark that she's got on the center of her bust. So that is the key. The key is the bust apex is the fullest part of the bust, the peak of the curve. Now it might be where your nipple is positioned, but it might not be. It might be that it's slightly higher or lower than your nipple, or left or right of your nipple. I would recommend when you're looking for the bust apex that you put on a bra or the underwear that you plan to wear when you're wearing the garment that you're making, because it can change the position of your breast. Take a look from the front and also take a look from the side because then you can really see where that fullest part of the bust is. Once you're happy with where the position of your bust apex is, then you can move on to my next tutorials where I'm going to be showing you how to find the bust apex on a pattern if it doesn't have one. And then more importantly, how to take measurements to your bust apex so that you're positioning your individual bust apex onto a pattern that you're working with. I really hope you enjoyed the tutorial and that you now really understand what a bust apex or bust point is and how to find it on a body. Thanks for watching and see you soon.